shoulder, Legionnaires, Rikon here, and welcome back to Dust. We are here with Raphael, and we are at Camp Forlorn Hope, now known as Hilltown. In the last, we took on the remnants of the Legion and the NCR all at the same time while bouncing over a minefield. We are hungry, we are thirsty. We're in need of some kind of reward. Let's hope we can find something here. And so with that, let us dive on in. Now we should have most of this camp devoid of any life. We can certainly hope. And I'm gonna be sneaking just so that we're not moving so fast as we drop on down here. I wanna make sure that we're not missing anything in particular while we are running about but at the same time we need to be ready at any moment to uh, start to unload our good old spears and already we are thirstier with advanced dehydration sickness come on fallen hope journal 2 tell you what we're gonna hold on to that until we can find the first so let's just keep on moving through these tents for now and see if we can find another Lots of places to sleep. Many. That might have something nice for us as well. Ooh, okay, duffel bag. Come on. Fall on Hope, Channel 3. Okay, we're getting there. <laughs> I feel like one's probably going to be closer to the start, if I had to guess. Nothing else in here. Okay. All right. And I don't think there's anything we can cook at the moment. We can make another tourniquet, but we'll just hold on to that belt for now. Let's see. No one down. So we're going up. Yeah, we might have to run back towards that little starting location. I mean, nice sight of the area, but not much else. I think this is where we were maybe being fired from. Actually, no, it was up there. Yeah. <clears throat> Damn, I think we can actually see someone up there. Yep, <laughs> we sure can. That's not so nice. That's a really good sight. So, let's be mindful of that. God, we're so thirsty. Yeah, we really need to find something here. We've got a few journals so far. And I don't think there was anything back here, right? Just junk. Yeah. I believe we checked up here as well. Alright. Is that a door? That's a door. It is. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Hilltown Mess Hall. Okay, so this could be very messy. So I think we are going to go with the power first and just really hope for the best here. Okay. Sorry. Not really sorry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh boy. Yep. Oh. Raphael. Yep. These NCR cannibals are no more. We were quick enough to take them out. Oh my gosh, a beer. And some squirrel bits as well. Fan. Freaking fantastic. I'm so happy. <laughs> Ah, it's the little things, huh? That'll help us. It definitely will help us. And these crispy squirrel bits will help us as well. All right, yeah, we're starting to get stuff down. Let's see, what do you have, friend? Nothing, really. Okay. Small scorched book. I want to make sure that we're not missing anything here. What about you, friend? A leather belt? Ah, uh, we don't really need it. And finally, you. Nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay. That is empty. That's fine. We'll go ahead and take that star. And let's head into the kitchen. This is the mess hall, after all. One would hope that they have something here other than human flesh. More empty bottles. Not liking that so far, team. Come through, please. We've got some rope. Okay. And it looks like it's more crispy squirrel bits. Hmm. And a non-functioning sink. Oh, we do have a Brahmin steak in the oven, though. We 
like that. We like that. And some ghost cans. All right. And a ghost fan, even. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. Advanced dehydration sickness. Yep. Yep. All right. Let's go ahead. We're going to have the crispy squirrel bits. That'll get us down a little bit further. And once we get a little bit hungrier, we'll have the uh, Brahmin steak. But that's good. That's good for now. We just still need some water. So let's hope we can find some. All right. Nothing else here. No other doors, right? Yep, that's that. Back outside. Okay. Let's see. Ooh. No, it's just the same old stuff. It's just a broken generator. Okay, and we are being noticed by someone or something. So, I think it's probably better if we actually do try and go a little bit slower at the moment. Let's be check out this next lot of tents. <sighs> Hi there, friend. I don't think you were the guy from all the way up there. But, looks like there are more here. And Oh my god, this is water. They've got water running through the camp. I am so happy right now. Okay. Wait, zero rads? How is this not irradiated? What? Uh, bottle all the water. Hang on. All purified? I mean, maybe they do have a pure source here. It, it's possible. Hot friggin' damn. Okay. <laughs> we'll take that, thank you. You know what? Well, do we need to have that much water on us? I mean, I guess... Let's try and have 20. That's still excessive. That's that's an excessive amount of water. But, uh... Yeah, I mean, we can just we can just drink the rest. Oh my god. Amazing. Well, that's that taken care of. Camp Fallen Hope. Coming in strong. Now, the cleaver that you had... I think we threw the other cleavers away. Yeah. There's got to be a crafting table here somewhere, right? Well, looks like we're good in the structure. Yeah, you could have been from up there. I don't see the guy at the moment, so... Okay, bunkhouse. I don't think there's any real point in us sneaking here. Because we're going to have to move fast, regardless. Hey! Sorry, friend. Oh, wow! Come on! Okay. Come on. All right. Messy, messy, messy. I know. All right. Bloody good job. Bloody good job, armor. And yes, we bloody made it. Another level up. Okay, so we are going to stick to the plan. As much as I want to start leveling up things like our melee weapons and our unarmed skill, I mean, we could try and get that up to 50 for the for this but honestly repair is where it is at we need to put everything we can into this okay so with 80 in there we're still gonna need i think we're getting like maybe 15 points per level so we're not gonna get there with one more level up which is kind of unfortunate unless we took something like here and now which that's quite tempting we could do that we could take here and now, and that would get us closer. No. I mean, 80 repair, that's really good. I think I want to go and put one more point in something else. Yeah. You know what? Screw it. We're going to put it in repair. We'll get as much in there as possible. And now, I think I want to go through, see if there's anything new. I don't think there's going to be. There's not going to be anything for repair, you know, until a while longer. I mean, okay junk rounds that's one thing so i'll be back after i've had a bit of a look through everything that we've got here okay i tell you what we are going to take here and now now i think getting closer to where we want to be for our next level up is going to be very beneficial to us and so with that bam we are now up a whole nother level and what are we going to take 
Well, we're going to take repair and we're going to go up as high as we possibly can. And you can see we're so close now. All we need is one more level up and we will be there. 96 repair. Once we get to 100, we're going to be able to pick up jury rigger. And after that, we're going to be able to... There's some very good things that we can do with that. What we are going to take for now, though, I think is probably going to be toughness. I do want to do tag eventually, but... Uh, yeah, getting our toughness up, just giving our general survivability up is going to be great. Stonewall is also great as well. That's an extra damage threshold against all melee weapons and unarmed attacks. We do have quite a few of those, but honestly, most of the damage that we get is from people far away. So, yeah, a slower walk speed is fine. I feel like we're already pretty fast, so we're going to go ahead and pick up toughness. We can pick this up again, so we could get a whole plus six, but... Yeah, I'm very happy with this overall. Let's check in and see how we're doing health-wise. Not great at the moment. Not great. So we need to try and see if we can get that back up. Uh, we could... Hmm. You know what? I think it's probably going to be eating things. It's mostly going to get us back up now. Yeah, we'll go ahead and use our Brahmin steak. There we go. And I suppose if we do get healing from water, we could just drink some of the water that's outside. Sunset Sarsaparilla, we don't need you anymore. No, we do not. Okay. Empty. Tis a shame. A bobby pin. Thank you very much. We will take that. Uh, there are some very good melee ones, uh, perks that I want to pick up eventually. Uh, they make us even worse at uh, shooting, so I think it's very good that we went in the direction of we don't use guns. Uh, more dog tags, we're gonna, yeah, leave those alone for now. Another empty duffel bag, that's unfortunate. Makeshift pistol, not for us. Carton of cigarettes, eh? Hmm. I'm probably gonna have to have a look at uh, some of the crap that we're carrying as well because uh, we are we're, we're getting close to that point again the point of having too much crap all right into the next room we've got lots of places to sleep some nice eyeglasses I see and in here settler outfit we can tear that up we can get a bandage out of that so we will looks like it's just a uh, microscope behind and a scalpel in the duffel bag. Okay, I see. There's a strong chance with our repair being so higher, so rather so much higher, we've unlocked some more things for us to craft at the different workbenches. So, yeah, that'll be a, a neat thing to check out as well. Uh, for now, though, I think I do want to go through and just have a look. 20 water is a lot. It's probably more than we need. I think we could get by with just 15 bottles of water. So... Yeah, I think we're actually going to go ahead and drop five of them here. Well, I say that now, but then again, you know what? I'm going to have a think about this one. Okay, I managed to get our weight down by a pretty decent amount. I would like to see some more HP, so we're going to have a bit of a drink when we pop outside. Yeah, we're going to be leaving everything else here on the ground for now. Should we need some of these things, we can always come back. I've decided to leave the bed roll, because... Yeah, I just, I don't think we're going to really need it. We could actually sleep here. Let's do that. I think that's going to be smarter. We'll go ahead and sleep. We can refill our bottles in the morning. Or rather just drink straight from the source. Okay, this is a little bit better. We could probably sleep for one more hour here. It is going to make us a lot hungrier and a lot thirstier. And you know what? I think we're probably going to take these peppers back. Because we can just go ahead and munch on them. Same thing with the uh, Lake Lurk egg. Yeah. We just need to get our... Uh, hunger down and this is going to get our thirst up but that's okay eat all those peppers wonderful lovely <laughs> nutrition is still nice and high we'll have the lake lurk egg mmm delicious wonderful 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 because we don't actually have a huge amount uh, of options for food still so I am hoping that we're going to be able to find a lot more here we have these small bean pods as well I think we could probably just go ahead and smash those back as well yeah let's do that we're going to go for all of them just like so and that's going to be 80 of our food down so we're looking a little bit better our sleep's a lot lower 420 on our thirst so we'll deal with that when we get back outside all right and outside we will go let's get some of that delicious water if we can we are definitely still being noticed by someone. Drink up, drink up. Get that H2O down. Little bit more here. Delicious, beautiful, 
clean water. The pepper's worn off. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. We've got ourselves another home. And what looked like some bathrooms as well. Ooh, a medical tent. Let's not get too close to there because that looks just, yeah, not good in general. Can't tell if there's still someone up there seeing us or we've got others. Oh, actually. Oh, 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 oh. Hi there. Hey, friend. Hello. Good night. We've got someone up here on a watchtower. Holy crap, what the hell? Whoa, you were naked, man. Okay. Well, something happened there. We'll go ahead and take that. Where the hell did you come from? That way. Okay. Oh, we've got others. And you're already injured, huh? Oh, critical strike. Yeah, we've got others here. Oh boy, oh boy. Take the bobby pin. Pull that spear out of him. We'll take that because we can turn that into a... Oh, ho, ho, ho. we can turn it into a bandage. All right, pretty good chance to hit him here. We'll go ahead for two just in case we miss. Oh, right in the chest. Right in the chest. Okay. We'll take that, thank you. You can keep your wrench. Any others here? God damn. Alright, things have gone quiet again. Who the hell were you then, huh? They were already injured, so they've been fighting someone. <sighs> Alright, we can breathe. I think I've lost a spear somewhere. Quite possibly. One of these blokes. We'll take that, sir. Thank you. Ah, no, it'll be you, right? Ah, nope, we still got others. Yep, I can see you up there. Damn, yeah, so there's, there's still quite a few more in this camp. More than I thought. Other than just in the buildings. Okay, so makeshift scythe. We're going to take this thing back. Uh, because it's just a great weapon in general. And we can still make use of that. And I think we probably want to try and head into one of these buildings. Because they're going to keep on flooding at us otherwise. And unfortunately... This power fist has taken a little bit of a beating. Still, it's good. And we'll put it to work. Hey. Don't even think about it. Okay. Well, what's done is done. What have we got, Wrath? Cannibal after cannibal. Now, I'm not sure if killing these cannibals is affecting our sanity. I gotta think it is. And I really want to get that under control. I really, really do. We pro we don't actually need that one, do we, right now? Forlorn Hope, Journal 6. Okay, so we really have not found the first one, have we? Yeah. Hmm. We could be putting things together. <laughs> Nothing else hidden here, huh? Yeah, we really need that food. Okay, well, we're gonna go ahead and move across towards the next shack. Just wait for that to appear. Okay, now we can go out. And we're gonna swap back anyway. I just need this to cross here. To feel a little bit safer. Meat locker. Could be good, could be good, could be bad. Hey. Wow. I've got you now. Oh shoot. That's just a straight up NCR trooper. And we've got other troopers locked in here. Well, I don't know how I feel about that. We'll take the nuts. Cell key. Hmm. Combat knife. We will definitely take you. Alright, you two just give me a second, okay? We just need to think about this thing. I don't need to kill them. Yes, they are the enemy, but they're locked in here for whatever reason. Maybe that's a good enough reason. But let's just make sure that they're not going to be able to uh, arm themselves. If anything, this is going to be a slow death for them. One will have to eat the other. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Don't mind me. We're just going to go ahead and take out some of our uh, <clears throat> tools. And we're going to see if we can repair this knife here using the combat knife. Okay. How are we looking? Yeah, 22 damage. Not bad. How is this looking at the moment? Still 36 damage. I think we can attack a lot faster with this though, and the crit chance is a lot higher, so we'll swap back to it for the time being. Yeah. 
Okay, and having a look at this, we're going to jump into our crafting kit. And we do actually need to do some stuff. Um, let's see. Tear you up. And make you into a bandage. Thank you. Alright, we can probably go ahead and use one of those bandages now. And jump back into our regular clothing. Nice. Well, we're going to be leaving you to it. See ya. Bandages worn off. We've still got a friend up there. Okay. What I would give for a whole heap of booze. That would go down like a treat. Okay. <laughs> Journal 5. Okay. It's got to be more over this way, I think. Let's see, this has got to be outside, right? Yep. We will go up to that one eventually. We want to make sure that we're staying inside the camp for now. Okay. Let's just see. Yeah, DT-23. Uh, damage threshold is nice. And that's the graveyard. Okay. Well, into the medical ward first, I think. And, uh, oh no, this is not, this is the butcher's tent. Lovely. Lovely, lovely people, huh? Okay. Where's the butcher then, huh? Diagnosed injured troop. They're alive. They've got them sedated. Well, I'm gonna take that blood pack, that whiskey, empty syringes, got a bone saw here. The bone saw can be useful to us. Medical brace can too. Yeah. Another bone saw. Those crutches are tempting. More empty syringes. Some scissors. Hmm. I don't think the butcher is here. Rather, the butchers are probably out there. We'll take the doctor's bag, some more whiskey. We don't need that many braces. Blood pack. That's still health. We can probably use some of that now, actually. Two knives and some paperweights. Okay, all locked up, huh? Hmm. Yeah, we're definitely going to use these blood packs. And unfortunately, we lost some of that dirty water, but I think that's fine. God, they've made a mess in here, huh? Well, that's all their food. Oh, it's Radix. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. All right. Jeez. It's messy stuff. Messy, messy stuff. So, blood packs. Oh, one HP? Yeah. I think we can probably use them to make certain stuff, but we're just going to go ahead and just use them for now. That's fine. Uh, we'll use another bandage. I want to try and see where our HP threshold is at nowadays. I'm pretty sure that's it. I mean, we could kill each, each of these people, but I, I don't... Yeah, close to death, he would not survive being moved. Yeah. We're not going to kill these people in their bed. That's not a good death. It's not an honorable death. Okay. Yeah, that's looking pretty good. Could just go drink some more outside as well. That's a pretty good option for us. And we're going to need to, because I'm going to go ahead and whack back that whiskey that we got. Yeah, we'll have that first lot. And go again. Restore that sanity. We're going to need a lot more than just those ones. Okay. So, let's just head over towards the river before we explore the rest of the place, because... Uh, well, we know there is more trouble here. And we're definitely being noticed still. Yeah, so it's bubbling up from the spring. Nice. Such a good find. Yeah. Oh, we're not getting that much in the way of HP from it, so... I thought the whiskey would have given us a lot more dehydration, but... Seemingly no. Okay. 
being noticed yet again. Let's just be ready to throw this spear. Yep, it's our friend all the way over there. Go for this first. Empty. I reckon I might be able to hurl a spear from here and hit that guy. What's the bet? Maybe if we aim up about there. Is that too high? Is that too low? Only one way to find out. Too high. He didn't even see it. Oh my god. Well. Hang on. Wait. What? That definitely hit him. Well, I guess say goodbye to those spears. Son of a bitch. Yeah, we're never going to see those again. Well, he's on his way. For better or for worse. Let's move around the expensive equipment. Hopefully they're not going to get attacked from the side here. You can't hurt me. I'm not really trying to, believe me. Okay. Nice big center mass shot. Here we go, dude. Hurl it. There we go. That one finds its mark. And that's the guy who hit us in the head, who crippled us, I think. Damn. Well, we got a hammer, so... <laughs> so we got one out of that. Okay. Alright. Let's head up this thing. Yeah, those other spears are long gone. <laughs> God damn it. I mean, these things will happen. Hey, I did change back my armor, right? I did. I did a good thing this time. I did. <laughs> God damn. Okay. Crafting kit. Let's go ahead and salvage that hammer. And get ourselves a throwing spear. That's one back. And you know what? Let's have a let's have a bandage. Actually, do we have food that we can have? Uh, not really, do we? No. Yeah, food is still a big issue for us. God damn. Well, we don't have to bandage right this second. We can hold off. Still want to check out the graveyard? Ah, empty. I did not notice that. All right, we we'll buy these tents now, so we'll clear them. We know we're good to continue. Empty. Damn, damn, damn. Ooh, okay. We've got ourselves another shed. Ooh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. And this is storage of some kind. We did find a key outside one of the guys to a storage shed. I don't think we've found that yet. Microfusion cells? Okay. Not bad. Not that we want them. Just, yeah, a whole heap of them. Hmm. Ooh, could be for that safe, maybe. That would be nice. Let's hope. No, it's just an empty safe. God damn, that's so anticlimactic. Well, I guess they decided not to store things out here. I mean, all the more power to them. All right, we've checked these tents back here. We'll pop into here. We'll say hello. Ah, oh, here we go. Storage shed. And it's unoccupied. Fantastic. That's what we want. So, dog meat. Lovely. We'll take you. What do we have in here? A bone saw. And surgical tube. Oh, Thorazine. Restore sanity. <laughs> yes. Now, I wonder if we use that now. Is that going to make us, like, like, fully sane? Because, like, we're unnerved at the moment, right? We're going to take the sugar bombs. Yes. Uh, I'm going to think about having that before we leave this space. We will, we will see. Okay, so more Wonder Glue, the Dino Toy, wrench and scrap electronics, another hammer. Sure, I will. I will actually go and make another spear. As soon as we lost those ones, empty syringes. Okay, oh a beer, lovely, lovely. Let's go ahead and just have that right now. Oh, is that what I think it is? It is. It's a workbench. No, it's a reloading bench. Oh my God, where are the freaking workbenches? Ah, just give me a crafting bench. God. Damn it. How hard is it to find those things? Ah, oh dear. Okay, we've got a scalpel up there. Anything else? Anything hidden? I cannot, I cannot believe that. That is so frustrating. <laughs> uh, okay, we can get an empty syringe from the morphine, huh? Nice. God damn. Okay, well, that's that, I suppose. Let's, let's just check in on Wrath and see how we're doing. In general... Uh, we are neutral, we're unsettled, but yeah, Caesar's Legion, we are vilified with the remnants of them. 
yeah, so there's that. Okay, jumping into here. Thorazine, are we going to use it now? I think so. All right, let's check in and see how we're looking. Still unsettled. Huh? Does it take time? Is it like a slow thing? Or is it just like an instant, this is what your sanity is at? I don't know how I feel about that. Because Thorazine can't bring you back from being insane. Once you're insane, that's it. You've gone too far. Huh. So maybe it just dropped it by a certain amount. We've nearly killed a hundred people. <laughs> oh my god. It really does uh, get away on you sometimes. Uh, right, nutrition's pretty high. Um, we could have the sugar bombs for now, and we will. We'll go ahead and have you. Have you. Okay, feeling a bit better after that. We're going to go and craft those uh, dog steaks into something useful. Same with you. And we'll go and salvage that hammer at the same time. Okay, throwing spear. Thank you, thank you. And, yeah, we could probably do with dropping a few things again. So, give it a second to just catch up with itself. Extra cloth strip we're not going to need. I also think that the scythe would be more usable uh, if we have it in pieces. <laughs> because we're not going to be using it right now because it's not in good condition. So, a crutch and a lawnmower blade. That should be a lot less for us to hold on to, I think. So, let's just check in this real quick. Crutch is two, lawnmower blade, four. Yeah, so it is just a little bit less. It's one less. And I can run with one less. All right, back outside. So, that's that. I guess that's just... Have we been inside here? My memory's failing me. <laughs> it, it, it's actually completely failing me. I don't know if we've been in there yet or not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Let's 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 have a let's have a peek. Uh no, we have not. Oh, you are bad. Why did I wait? Why did I wait? God damn it. Yeah, we're just the our bullet is just absorbing armor right now. Uh right our armor is res our armor is absorbing bullets right now. God damn. Don't have this sucker. Okay, get behind the blackboard. Let's just wait here a second or two. Dodge around him. All right, here we go. You made a mistake swapping guns, man. You should have just stuck with what you got. Slash away, my friend. Slash away. Critical strike and he is down. Right. Yeah, no, he definitely had not been inside here. God damn. Okay. Well, that's that. The last of the NCR in this place. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have waited. I shouldn't have waited. We're going to take the patch skin. We can turn that into something. Yeah. I just, uh, yeah, she looked a lot younger. I thought she was a kid. Raphael hesitated. I hesitated. What have we got? Makeshift rifle, a whole heap of generators. Okay, surely we've got some good things in here. A knife and a scalpel. So many wrenches, god damn. Yeah, not a bad supply. Lots of wonder glue. Is there not a, a bench in here? There isn't. <sighs> Sons of bitches. Lots of detergent. Sure, okay. Did I check you? I did not, you have a hammer on you. Well... I think we're, honestly, I think we're okay. We've got eight of them at the moment. That's a good number. A nice number. Where is journal number one, huh? It's gotta be, it's gotta be somewhere. Big book of science. I mean, we'll flick through it because there's a good chance there's some useful things in there for us. If we could find a book that taught us repair, I'd be so happy right now because then we'd, we'd just be, we'd be done. We would be done. So, let's see. Uh, big book of repair, huh? Or rather, big book of science, big book of repair. That's what I want. Ah, uh, no, three wouldn't be enough as well. Yeah. We need a little bit more than that. Okay, there's some pre-war money in there. Duffel bag is empty. Duffel bag is empty. Okay. Toolbox. Sensor module. Lots of empty things. Plunger. That's got some wood, but pass it up for now. Okay, well, that's that. No journals in here, really? Yeah, nothing. And that's the last of them in here. Yeah, that's that. 
Well, back outside for now then. Back into the night. We're pretty sure we're still being observed by someone. Something. We'll jump over towards the graveyard. See what we got going on down there. It's a two-tiered graveyard by the looks of things. No mines here, please. That would be pretty ruthless. Lots of voices in this space. Oh, hello. Hmm, machete. I will definitely take that, thank you. And then there's that blowfly that was uh, floating. More than one of them. And that's that. Nothing else here, huh? Well, let's go ahead and get out our equipment. Uh, we'll go ahead and make this bandage before I forget about it. What did I just eat? Son of a bitch. <laughs> Misclicks aren't fun. I'm not sure what that was. Oh, it was cat eye, right? That's why we can see. I apologize, the screen's gonna look a little weird for a little bit now. I mean, maybe we can see a little bit better. Who knows? Ah, oh, dear. Alright, Machete, let's give you a decent repair. 20 damage, not bad, but a uh, uh, bowie knife is still going to be better in general. Okay, we can actually see pretty good with this. So, sure, there we go, congratulations, we got cat eye for the night. Or for a little while. An accidental dosage, but here we are. So, where do we think this last journal is? Rather, the first journal. Surely it's got to be near the start of the town. And so far, almost every one of the journals that we've found has been inside a, uh, a footlocker of some kind. So I would have to think, surely, surely they'd be in there. Mm. But where, oh where? Where have we missed a footlocker? Because this was like three, right? Three, and then it was like two... So, I would imagine one would be in one of these, right? If that was the case. Check that duffel bag. Yeah. Well, I think we might just have to put together what we can without that extra one. And suffering beer withdrawal. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. Don't you worry. Okay, so, let's start having a bit of a read. Uh, it's going to be under our notes, yes? Okay, so we got two, three, five, and six. Okay, all right. Dear Leon, straight up begged the mayor for the walls this morning. It was kind of pathetic, really. Sure, there have been lots of attacks lately, but it's like shooting mole rats. I don't know what he's so afraid of. Contact with the other camps has been completely cut off for the past two weeks. I don't even know if they survived the storm. Might be we're the last people out here. If it were up to me, I'd say we pack up and head out. Maybe try to find some other survivors and get back to the NCR. But it's not up to me. The ward ran out. Fuck. Three more deserters last night. Three more heads on our front doorstep this morning. They're picking us off like flies. I see. Well, apparently, they did find water eventually. They must have broke ground and found that spring, because that, that, that's a spring. Totally a spring. <laughs> yeah. Well, I think this is the camp complete. As best I can tell, beautiful, unirradiated water, which we're going to go ahead and slurp again. Mmm, very good. And we'll go ahead and have a dog steak as well while we're here. Yeah, thank you. Very, very nice. Delicious. Nutritious. Okay. Back around this way. And back out the other side of town. Definitely want to make it up there, because that's where someone was watching out. But I'm pretty sure that someone is dead now. If I had to guess. If we put our spear away, we are going to run a little bit faster. I gotta think that they've probably mined to the front here as well. And I think that's where cat eye is gonna be both good and bad because uh, we're not gonna be able to see the color of the mines at night. Because it's all just this washed out, desaturated blue tone. 
Okay, we're good. We've got a big old radio tower there as well. I'd like to make it up to there if we can. Whiskey, be gone. Let's get this out just in case there is someone still lurking around here. <laughs> and Cat Eye finally wears off, okay. But we can still see pretty damn good. Vegas is very far away right now. Gotta be something here, right? Nothing! Empty watchtower. Unfortunate. Very unfortunate. Well, that's that. And so, Raphael, where to from here? Well, I think immediately we're going to go straight to the radio tower that's here. But then I think we're going to go to the dam, if we can. Try and see what was left of this secondary attack. Yeah. Maybe Lake Mead. At the same time, though, I believe the rumors that we heard about, uh, what was it? Uh, Understone. I think, I think maybe it was actually over in this direction. I, I legitimately, Rikon, I can't remember exactly where it was. I knew it was, like, around somewhere. I think it might be a little bit more to the south, possibly. <laughs> so we're gonna have a, far t uh, a, a fun time finding that. And I think we really do need to find it. Um, yeah, I think before trying to go to the dam, that's going to be the right call for us. However, for now, we will carry on. We've got a railroad. Yeah, we'll carry on just up to this here. Let's see if there's any anything else here. I doubt it, though. It's not seen that way. I stand corrected. I stand corrected. Or maybe not. Or if they're here, they're not here, you know? Hmm. Okay. Well. <laughs> I need to find us a way to Understone. <laughs> <laughs> Try to. I uh, honestly, I think if we if we head down in this region here, I'm pretty sure it was around here. Pretty sure. So we're gonna have to kind of head back in that direction there, kind of up along that path. Yep, we can do that. We'll try and s stick to that bearing as best we can. I don't know who's firing and what they're firing at, but it's not us right now, so. We'll let them be. Leave me alone, we'll leave you alone. And I mean, they did start that back there. We were just climbing some rocks, minding our own business, and then... Pop. Yep. They picked the wrong fight. And then somehow we find ourselves between the Legion and the NCR. Well, I say the Legion. It's certainly not the Legion anymore. Far from it. Just remnants. Like Raphael, but uh, I feel like Raphael's kind of held it together a little bit more. Even if he is by himself. Desolate. Not a thing. No animals. Nothing. We've got a little bit of food left in our bag. Ooh. We've got a lot of windmills over here. What have we got? We can't be certain. We do have a dog steak, which we'll have for now. Mindful of mines. Let's see what these windmills are. If it's just settlement, we'll leave them be. Ah, Casadors. Of course, of course. Why not? Why not, huh? Okay, young Cazador. Can we nail you with one of these? We can, but it's honestly not going to do all that much by the looks of things. We'll try and go for two to the torso. Oh my god, we're not wearing armor! How did this happen? How did this happen? We're not wearing anything at all? We're just completely naked? Oh my god, put on armor. Put <laughs> what, what is going on? How did I do that? Hang on. Oh, there it is. Tribal power armor. Oh my god. What the hell happened? I don't, I, I don't know how that happened. I do not know how that happened. 
Can I get a fist out, please? Thank you. Or rather, a blade? Oh, here it is. Young Kazdor. We're going to go ahead and try and give it a, a dirt nap. Or two. Or three. Or four. Watching for poison. Oh, God. Oh, yep. That's definitely poison. And we've got anti-venom to help counteract that. And we're going to go ahead and take that. Anti-venom. All right. Ooh. Okay. Okay. We're all right. We're all right, Raph. We're all right. Didn't damage us that much. That's good. The armor held up. The young Kazador is empty. So many are in this wasteland. And luckily, these were just young Kazadors. <laughs> God damn. Okay. Well, that was something. That poison. That's why we're carrying that anti venom. And yes, we. We do have, uh tourniquets, but, uh, yeah. Oh, shoot, I remember. I remember this now. We're gonna have a lot more Cazadors around here, I think. Or is that a bloatfly shooting at us? Oh, no, it's something up there. Oh, it's a tunneler. Oh, no, oh, 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 no, okay, it's you. It's you. Hello, ugly. Hi. All right, chance to hit your head is pretty slim. All right, centaurs are, uh, you got a lot of health, buddy, but you're also a very big target. And I'm just gonna go ahead and throw all my spears into your ugly body and kill you because we can. God damn, okay, let's take those six spears back. The centaur blood, you, you, can, you can keep your blood. I don't want, I don't want any of that. Alright, that's a hit. It's another hit. You aren't so good at hitting though, are you? Come on. That's not good. That's very, that's very bad. This is, uh, maybe explosives territory? Okay, definitely explosives territory. 110%. Uh, what do we want to use? We want to use something big and bad. Multi-blast grenade? Sure. Oh, definitely. Most certainly. Come on. Chuck it right there. There we go. Get them. What? That did nothing. That did absolutely nothing. Okay. Tunnel of Queens. Two Tunnel of Queens. Okay. Molotovs. Fire. Fire works against these things. Okay. Yeah. You better bloody stay back. You took down one of the big boys. I am impressed. I'm very impressed. Okay. Well... We're stuck between a rock and a hard place. The hard place being these two queens. Are they both queens? No, that's a hulking tunneler. Okay. Yeet. <laughs> okay. The abomination panics and flees. Yeah, but how far are you going to flee? Not far enough by the looks of things. We've only got... <laughs> we're running on limited spears here. The hulking tunneler we can fight. The others we cannot. Oh boy. Another hogging tunnel over there. Nice, nice crack, friend. Uh, right. Not a great situation we find ourselves in here. We got ourselves a structure over towards the side. <laughs> oh boy. Well, you know what would be nice right about now? Some spears. We're, we're, we're completely out right now. We are completely out. Fantastic. So, what are we going to do? we got frag mines. We can try and blow them up that way. Uh, the grenades and all the rest, they're not going to be able to do enough damage. Plasma mine, you would imagine it would be able to do enough, but I honestly don't think it will. We can jump up here, seemingly easily enough. And they're both, they were both off in this direction, right? Yeah. So we can maybe try and bait them into getting hit by this mine. Okay, just back on up. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Okay, hey there, friend. Okay, now a regular hulking tunneler. <laughs> a regular hulking tunneler. I'd be okay with us fighting them a little bit, but only a little bit here. Hmm, not good, not good. 
So I think that one is the one that has all of our um, spears on, I believe. Yeah. Okay. We're just going to have to go for it. Deep breath and make a run. Here we go. Here we go. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. Back we go. Okay. Did some damage there. That's good. A little bit more. A little bit more. That queen is going to be big trouble for us. Oh, boy. Yep. This is going to happen. And I can see they're just, they're just hiding. They're just waiting. Smart creatures. But hey, look, this is why we have these things. This is why we have these mines and all the rest, is so we can use them against creatures like this. And they will come for us. They will. Sometimes they'll get stuck. Other times they'll just run towards and blow on up. Yep. Just little by little, we're going to have to whittle them down like this. And I'm okay with that. Critical strike. I will take that. Thank you. Take that queen down a notch or two. Alright, come on. They're all a lot slower now because we've been crippling their legs. Okay, we've split the queen off from the... Oh, we haven't, exactly. But this is the method we are going to use to hunt these tunnelers. Oh, that did nothing. I think it was just bad mine placement. Okay, well, that's our mines, I believe. <laughs> we still have some other explosives that we can use, and... Uh, I mean, I'm tempted to try and use them. The idea might be to just try and get them nice and close close to each other. As you can see, they take a second to reset. Threw that right in front of them. Okay, that went way too far. That was a terrible throw. Go ahead and throw it so that we can get them while they're retreating. Here we go. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Oh my god. Why does it take so long to attack? Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Oh my god. Holy crap. Yep, that's the power of a queen. That is the power of a queen. Look at us. Absolutely decimated our arm. Yep. Doctor's bag, that thing. Holy crap. And look at our health as well. Okay, we're actually going to go ahead and take a stim pack now. Because we need to have a little bit more allowance <laughs> in health. But that queen is dying. We are getting her. We managed to knock her on, the, on her ass with that explosive. If it didn't take us so long to swap our weapons, we would have been in the clear there. But unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately not. Uh, makeshift homemade pipe bombs do make quite the bang. So we could make use of them. And I think we're going to try and do that. Go and ch chuck on a bandage real quick. Just try and get them to come towards us. This is the real battle right now. If I could get those spears, we would be in the clear, but, uh, yeah. Even though they're slow, they're still fast enough, I think. Okay, pipe bomb's gonna take a second or two to blow up. That uh, took way too long. Oh, we killed, we killed one. Okay, that's a miss. That's fine. Hey, queen. Hey. Now, the other hulking tunnel is still quite <laughs> healthy, unfortunately. Okay, let's move to you. Loot your body. A radiated tunnel of meat, of course it is. Alright, after the big boy. Here we go. Oh, tunnel queen is nearly dead. Is it... Okay, the Hulking tunnel is still out here. Am I willing to, to, to risk getting hit by the queen again? Or are we going to try and blow her up? I'll try and blow her up with the other. Can we get the other to come back at the same time, though? No, not really. Oh, God. Yeah, that's a miss. Oh, my God. That's my mistake. We're doing this thing. We're doing this one way or the other. This is it, Raph. Come on, dude. Oh, that's it. Queen down. Okay. And just some cave fungus. God damn it. Okay, well, we need a little bit more health up here. 
Let's have some water. <laughs> oh my god. Wow, this was, uh, this was something. So, yeah, we'll go ahead, we'll have some purified water, we'll take some healing powder at the same time, that's gonna be a nice, long, slow heal. And we're gonna have to take care of that hulking tunneler, but we might be able to get to this in time. I think we are. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Get that stuck spear. Anyone else here? I don't think so. And here he comes. Let's go ahead and make sure this is back on three. Alright. Here comes that hulking tunneler. Okay, that's a hit. We can keep on moving back, but I think a good few strikes to the head might be enough to do it here. Oh, there we go. That is it, Raphael. That is it. That's how we do this thing. Grab the hide as well. Okay. We did it. We survived this bloody encounter, and it was a big encounter. Look at this ugly son of a bitch. Evolved centaur. And just some centaur blood. Alright. I want to make sure that we didn't leave any other spears in these people. No. And the queen. Yeah, the queen unfortunately didn't have all that much for us. Just a mangled old head. So we got some irradiated meat. And I believe we might have some other spears that could have possibly missed. Around here somewhere. More than likely past this point. Could be. Could be. Oh. Okay, we've got a Kazdor that's down there. That would have been courtesy of one of the... Uh... Centaurs. Yep. Okay. Well. Into the shack then, I think. Holy crap. Yep, definitely into the shack. I have no idea what all that fighting was about. Maintenance shit? That doesn't- that doesn't sound like good weapons. That sounds like a whole heap of bad. Maintenance shack. Okay. Oh my god. Finally. Finally. <laughs> Dean's Electronics. We'll go ahead and take that. Holy crap. Well, it has been a long road to get here. Uh, no, I don't, I, I don't eat the nails. <laughs> I don't know why I'm taking them. Uh, I've just been playing a lot of Cataclysm, and as soon as I see nails, I'm like, grab them. Grab the nails. Ooh, pickaxes too. How nice. Okay. Wow. We can breathe. Weapon repair kit. Thank you very much. We're definitely going to take that. Probably use that on the power fist if I had to guess. Yeah. Oh boy. There is something very weird going on with the mouse in here. Alright. Well, <laughs> let's go ahead and use um, the power fist. We'll put that on and go to the weapon repair kit. Get this fixed if we can. As much as, as much as we can. We'll actually put on our handyman jumpsuit, which puts us up to 100, I believe. Yeah. Use it. And how does that help? Quite a bit. Quite a bit. Nice. Activate workbench. Ah, <sighs> Makeshift scythe. So we can make the scythe. What are we missing out on for the blade? So, let's see. Makeshift sword. We need a hammer. Okay. And, uh, what's the damage? Damage is 30, so it's gonna be pretty fast. It's 55 for that. Yeah? And what is, what is the makeshift scythe gonna do for us? 64 and 32. Bonus critical chance. I'm tempted to go for the sword here, because it's gonna be faster. Just having a look at the axe as well. Axe is not bad. Hmm. Yeah, just trying to decide what's going to be the best makeshift weapon for us, really. Yeah, it could be the sword. Okay, tell you what. Let's grab a hammer. Let's get that thing made. Makeshift sword. Okay. And it is, it does look like we're making it, um, close to complete. A little bit under its kind of threshold, but yeah, junk sword. How does that stack up against the bowie knife, though? The bowie knife is still going to be better, I think. Well, maybe not. Maybe not. Let's have a look at this thing. Ooh. We hold it, interestingly. Let's see. Oh, we are holding it two-handed. 
It's honestly, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. I like it. Yeah, I think we're going to make use of this weapon. Uh, unfortunately, there isn't anything else in here for us. And there could be some other things in this uh, menu that we could be interested in crafting. And I tell you what, I'm going to have a look through that, but I'm going to do that off camera because, well, guys and gals, we have made it to the end of the episode. Somehow we managed to survive against Tunnel and Queens and Cazadors and a camp full of angry NCR cannibals. Just another day in this man's life. And let's hope there are many days still to come. If you enjoyed today's episode, please consider leaving a comment or a like to let me know if you enjoyed the show. For now, I have been Rykon. You have all been awesome. And until next time, stay tuned.